Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, Big Game Zone Burn here. And today we're going to be playing some Euro Truck Simulator 2, and it's just going to be pure awesome. Now we're going to start off the day by, um, first of all, uh, heading to bed and uh, starting a new mission. So let's go ahead and let's find the nearest shop. Just going to go ahead and get some rest really quick. I'm guessing nobody's coming. Go around. Oh, that's a truck. That's a truck too. Now we're back on the road. Oh yeah. But yeah, I know I haven't been on in a while. A very, very long while. Like, while, 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 while. But yeah, uh, Thanks for uh, subscribing, thanks for being around, and you know, we're here to stay. I just upgraded my internet, so we're going to have a lot of live streaming going on. You hear that, you couple of people that are on my live stream currently? I'm going to be uh, live streaming some more here, so feel free, become a liker, do what you have to do. So yeah, we're just going to go ahead and hurry up and see what we're going to do over here, because we're going to drive, and we're, I did not totally just drop my iPod, which I totally just dropped my iPod. <laughs> it's like I mentioned, we're just going to go ahead and go to bed, in this game that is, and we're just going to make it friggin' awesome. Very friggin' awesome. Almost crashed into that wall over there. So, just a quick question: How many of you guys like uh, G25 wheels? I think they're friggin' awesome. I've been using this wheel for quite a while now. <laughs> Very funny. Yes, I'm saying that on purpose, and I did not mean to run that red light. So basically, in Euro Truck Simulator 2, I'm building up a company that's meant for speed, speeding deliveries, whatever. And basically, so far it's been so good. I mean, I've started new profiles, which basically I just did uh, long haul deliveries for a while, and that was just fucking awful. The deliveries were so long, and you have to stay over and go to bed do whatever it is that you have to do, so that really, really sucked. <laughs> but when you're doing these fast deliveries, it's like, if you're not speeding with the speed limiter off, you're not going to be able to get anywhere, so yeah. Let's see if we could get a nice, long mission. Okay, that's maybe longer than I thought. I'm going to see if I can choose a long trailer. It'll make it easier for me to do everything if I get a long trailer. So, you know what, 28. This is paying 30. Mm, so many missions. And this pays 17 for ice cream. Okay, 30, 68. Any better offers? Alright, it seems like we're going to be shipping ice cream. Ice cream! Yay! So, let's back up here. Neutral. Drive. Put on the turn signal. Enter into a shipping company that's just give me, gonna give me a container that probably goes around 34,000 euros, which I'll probably end up crashing anyways. Got a couple of modifications I'm playing with, so it is frigging awesome. I have a no damage modification, and basically, if you guys ever played this game, you would know that normally the trucks would all be um, four by twos. Um, this modification gives the uh, trucks diversity between what drive there are, and in addition to that, for AI trucks. Um, 
they could have any modification you could get in shop for your normal truck so I guess it's pretty awesome for the most part so let's go over here we're gonna be speeding off yeah that's right you hear that horn yeah it looks like I'm a little horny okay let me stop it it's just too early for that way too early what time is it early yeah it's too early Here we go. Make a right, make a right, shift up, shift up, shift up some more, shift up again, and pass this idiot, shift up, right turn, shift down, shift up, and left. Here we are. Here we go. Let's pick up this ice cream, and let's be on our way. That's right ice cream. I said it right. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Alrighty, here we are. And there we go. Attach. First gear, second gear. I feel like I'm teaching a little kid how to drive a stick shift. Maybe you are little kids, and I am teaching you to drive stick shift. I don't know what that sign means. I think it means like yield or something. I'm not from Europe or whatever this game is. I think it's like your own truck simulator or something. I think it's uh, supposed to simulate like the Euro dollar driving a truck or something. Just kidding. Here we are. I'm gonna be getting onto this road, straightening out. Shifting up. We're gonna deliver this ice cream as soon as possible. You know, one thing I noticed while delivering this ice cream is that the refrigerator is so small. It's barely so it's just uh, so weird. So um, let's just run this red light. That's right, PD. You heard that. Let's slow down a little. delivery as fast as possible because I don't like ice cream. Actually, I'm lactose intolerant. So, we'll see what's up. And it looks like we're going to be stopping here. I normally don't obey lights. Especially when starting out with, um, you start out with like 450 horsepower, which compared to the Scania, you start out with around 345 horsepower, which just sucks. Like Scania, step your game up. Volvo is beating you. You're talking about the people who make box cars. Box cars, Scania. This is sad. You know, I've always wanted to see a European truck here in the United States hauling our cargo. I wonder how weird that would be. Like, yeah, take that, Europe. We have Scanias here in America, too. Well, I know that we have, uh, man, not trucks, but buses. Here in, uh, New York City, we have the man double, well, not double deck bus, but accordion bus thingy mcjigger shit man jensen no clue what it is but it's pretty cool <laughs> yeah i guess it's uh pretty funny so yeah for you guys that are on twitch tv right now hit that little favorite button see that button it's a little heart you hit that 
and it basically tells you if I'm online or not, so it will be awesome. That's what you have to do. And um, I'm going to have some Arma gameplay coming soon. And in addition to Arma gameplay, um, probably some Grand Theft Auto. I think the Grand Theft Auto LCPDFR would just be a bunch of fun, especially for uh, Twitch. I really don't see anything like that on, so yeah. And then if you guys have any suggestions what I should be doing, you know, feel free to tell me. And uh, you guys on YouTube, check me out on Twitch. And you guys on Twitch, uh, check me out on YouTube, uh, Epic Game Zone. Highly doubt it's ever going to change. So, yes, yes, yes. And here we are. I'm speeding off. And I totally wasn't speeding all of this or Freaking cameras. Who invented cameras anyways? What good are they for? No, taking photos. Do you? But not issuing tickets. That's just plain, cold, hard meanness pay your taxes, you get on your truck and you need to pay tickets. I really don't get it. It's a system built of corruption that will never end. Play dramatic Pokemon music. So yeah, only um, seven in-game hours to go with uh, 38 in-game minutes. So let's try to race against this clock to see how fast we could actually get there with, um, let's see, it is expected at 15.17 and it's 6.30 currently, so just going to be hitting this road as fast as possible. hundred and thirty one kilometers an hour. This is uh, pretty intense. I mean, the fastest I've ever gone was what? 126 kilometers an hour in this game? Psst. Weak. I could go faster than that on my moped. Oh, that guy wants to race. I could tell he wants to race. He's so lucky I'm getting off at this exit. Stuck up, bitch. Alright, let's just uh, shift down a little, down a little more. Shift down maybe um, one more time. There we go. And let's take this turn nice and smooth. There you go. So, yeah, I configured my. Uh, Logitech uh, Driving Force GT. It is just awesome. The force feedback is just uh, realistic. It feels like the engine just wants to take you and just rip you away, man. You wouldn't even understand. It's just amazing grace. How sweet. Yeah. Pretty much that good. Oh, well, um, here we go. Just on this deserted highway. No traffic, no nothing. Friggin' awesomeness. I mean, one thing that amazes me about this game is you'll never run into a traffic jam. Like, just a full out blown traffic jam when everybody's doing absolutely nothing just sitting there creating traffic bumper to bumper traffic that's boring and obnoxious okay now I see whoa okay I wish I could really be going that fast I just love how like that was just so unrealistic SCF software I want my money back this is supposed to be a driving simulator not a whatever the hell that was 
I've never seen anything like that in this game until this very moment. So you guys are very lucky to be seeing something like that. Ready? Gonna be shifting down. Taking this corner nice and easy. So I don't crash into that truck directly in front of me. Okay. As soon as I take this bend, just go full out once again. Here we go. And there's a straightaway I was looking for. Woohoo! That's right, you're losing the race. The truck race. Uh huh, you have a, what, 95 kilometer speed limit. But yeah, if you guys were trying to look for that mod earlier, if you saw in the front of the Scania, the visor was uh, one of the ones that you would have to buy in shop, which. This modification is just friggin' awesome. For you guys on YouTube, I will have the link for you. Because I love you. Well, but I love... Hold on. It's because I love you guys. And feel free to hit that subscribe button. You know, that little red button. that, Or if I usually say subscribe, people start to unsubscribe. But if I don't say anything, they usually subscribe and I just got a ticket. Oh, no ticket. I'll take it. But yeah, basically you hit that subscribe button to subscribe to me. Now if you hit the X, you could unsubscribe. So if you don't want to hear enough of my mouth, especially on this, these very long, annoying journeys, that's exactly what you have to do. And for you guys that are watching these very long, annoying journeys, my suggestion is get Euro Truck Simulator 2. And in addition, you know, in a few days, there's actually um, another game coming out. I'm not sure what it's called, but it's by SCF Software. And basically, a bunch of people were complaining about, is Euro Truck Simulator 2 going to be online? And supposedly, there's this developer team making it online. Blah, 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 blah. Well, Euro... Uh, sorry, SCS Software, the company that created... Oh, nobody saw that. Okay. Nobody saw that. Okay. Just uh, gonna make this a hit and run. Nobody called the insurance, but... Going back to what I was saying. Uh, SCF Software, the company that made Euro Truck Simulator 2, American Long Haul, and all these great other games. They claim that they're going to be making this game that's supposed to be uh, universal. I have some updates on it eventually. But the point of the game is just to be uh, friggin' awesome online multiplayer glory, love, butthole, sex, whatever. Uh, <laughs> basically, I think they're just going to be expanding Euro Truck Simulator 2 and making American maps and just throw on multiplayer on it. I think it's just going to be friggin' awesome. So yeah, that car crash, truck crash, thing crash got me a little stirred up. So I'm just going to be driving here, acting like that never happened. Just, uh, now some of you guys are going to be like, Why did you have no collision? This, that, this, that. It's because I'm a horrible driver and I crash into everything. Especially on uh, roads with passing lanes, I tend to uh, pass and get into a serious accident. So, yeah my total luck over there, so... Okay... So the mission is gonna be... 6 hours and 30 minutes remaining. 
looks like I'm still going to be there on time for the most part, and I'm going to get a speeding ticket this time. I know it. There it goes. Yes. Pay that fine. The funny thing is I have a garage, and uh, apparently the garage isn't breaking even only on the employees. So basically, if I go to bed and I wake up in this key... Nobody saw that either. If I go to bed and I wake up in this game, I will be in outstanding debt that will be horrible. So that makes me not want to go to sleep in this game. But since it is a simulator, and I'm trying to simulate a simulator thing, I tend to uh, just leave the sleep thing on. Which is not a very good option in my opinion, but we'll see about it in the future. But one thing that I find very awesome compared to this uh, Driving Force GT and this Volvo is that the grips, they're the exact same, so it feels like when I'm gripping this wheel, I'm gripping the actual Volvo. It is just friggin' awesome. And if you're thinking of buying a Driving Force GT, take my word, it is worth it. Just uh, shut up and take my money, or take your money. Take who's ever money. Just get one. Get one. It is worth it. And if you don't get one, we're going to have some serious problems at the end of the day. Like right now, what time it is? Don't, no clue what time it is. But basically, if you don't get one by the end of the day, there's going to be some serious problems up in this bitch. Very serious problems. The kind of problems that make you never want to come home ever again. The kind of problems that make the shows like the first 48 the shows they are today, okay? Now, you don't want to be in some of those problems, so, like, hurry up and buy one of these wheels. I'm going to be slowing it down. Got this uh, jackrabbit rigger right in front of me. And let's speed it up just a little. There you go. Shift up. Shift. Basically, shift up and twist. I don't know what that means to you, but to me it means a lot. So, you know, shift up and twist. So, what is this? Hamburg, Bremen, and Kiel. I don't think I'm going to any of these places, but let's go ahead and go to these places. So, for you guys that normally play this game, you would know that all tolls, truck stops, and all these other things, they're just very obnoxious and annoying. Which makes me want to play this game even longer because it's somewhat realistic. I think they should add uh, police officers that actually pull your truck over. Because I'm sick of getting tickets every time I run a damn red light without any cops being around. It gets very, very annoying. We're going to have 131 kilometers to go, so uh, let me just uh, stop here, and let's get some fuel in the truck. There he goes. When I'm doing that, let's shift it down to neutral. And let's see how many tea liters I'm going to buy so I could be on my way, Dally ho 621 liters, which 908 euros. And let's see how much money I have to pay. Never mind. Here we go. Back on the road. Time to test it out. Hopefully with this mission I could, uh, level up to the next level and be awesome because when you're not awesome you're lame you hear that all you people on my feet if you're not awesome you're lame lame I tell you lame 
That does not go for you YouTube people. You're just freaking awesome for using YouTube and being awesome. But, um, you know, if I was a real truck driver, I would just stop this truck over, open up the back, and be like, just gonna sample some of the ice cream, make sure all the refrigerative service in the trucks are working fine. And here we go, I'm gonna get another speeding ticket. Oh. Nope, not this time. Alrighty, so... This mission is gonna be over very, very soon. It went from, what, a bunch of hours to one and a half. So yeah, I do apologize for the crashing earlier. That was just a bit horrible. Now, this video was not meant to be a professional simulator video. You see, what happened was I'm just trying to tell everybody in YouTube that we're back. Epic Game Zone is back. And you know, thanks to Gecko365, uh, shout outs to Vizo TV, uh, Broadband TV, Broadband Networks. You guys are the best. And um, basically, I'm going to be looking for some channel art designers and stuff like that. So if you're a channel art designer, you know, uh, hit me up and we can get something going very, very soon. But yeah, I highly doubt any channel art designers will watch this video to the end in the first place. So, you know, we're going to see what's up for the most part. I wish that scene Anders was here. Seen honors. Nah, he's definitely not here. You know, if you say his name, it's sort of like Jesus. Except with more cheese and trolls and awesomeness. So yeah, no more seen honors. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch of cables preventing me from hitting the brake pedal. bend and we're almost there I guess I'm on time because of stupid little music that says you're almost late did it come on <laughs> but it was awesome now for you guys that are trying to look at the little webcam thing um, I totally don't have a good position to place this webcam so you're looking at the back of the steering wheel and not at my face or anything else. So, you know, if this is what gets you off, enjoy. Enjoy it a lot, okay? I want you to enjoy it till your heart's content to seeks out and blood seeks from your soul. Okay, that was a little bit harsh. Till something seeks from your soul. It's not love. It's ne definitely not love. It's never love. It's never love. But yeah. Okay, so we are almost there. And you guys are going to watch my awesome trailer parking skills. Which, uh, mind you, I can't park a trailer for anything. Now for you guys that are wondering what kind of TV screen I'm gaming on, so imagine seeing what you're seeing now on a 40 inch TV that's directly in front of you while you're using a freaking Logitech steering wheel. Yes, it doesn't get any better than that. Actually, um, I'll turn the webcam around in a few minutes just to uh, show you as soon as I finish parking. Actually, uh, Thanks to, can't really see your name, but thanks to somebody in my chat room on Twitch TV, that's exactly what I'm going to be doing. So here we are. 
gonna be moving up just a second. Move. Okay, there we go. We're moving now. Oh my gosh, look what this guy's shipping. He's shipping your mom's dildo. And two back panel thingies. Ready. Here we are. Okay. This is going to be one of the easiest parkings I've ever done. So let's go over here. Turn this trailer around. And bam. Straighten it out. Now we're just going to totally hit it in reverse. There it goes. Out of gas. What the there it goes. Okay, I said it. There it goes too many times. That's what's going on. Okay, so stop. Go back in reverse. And wah. There we go. Yeah, new level. Yeah. Okay, so let's do some high-valued cargo. Apply. And for you guys on Twitch TV, actually on YouTube as well, you guys are very lucky. You're going to be seeing the kind of build I run here. Well, let's remove this. And bam! 40-inch TV wonder. And, uh... PS3 Wonder and a bunch of other shit on my desk I don't really need Wonder. But yeah, that's uh, my gaming setup. It is freaking awesome. But thank you for watching. Subscribe and favorite me on Twitch or whatever it is that you soulless people use.